Today we're going to install the Navajo keyboard layout on an Apple computer. Go ahead and select the link on this blog post here to take you to Chris Harvey's uh, language resource site called languagegeek.com. And once you have that open, scroll down and find the American Southwest link underneath the keyboard maps and keyboards title. It'll take you down to about the center of the page. We will be installing the Mac or selecting the Mac download. After that's installed, go ahead and open your downloads folder. And there should be a zip file. Go ahead and unzip that file. Verify that the keyboard layout file is sitting in that folder and let's open a new folder go ahead and go to this folder here library keyboard layouts let's put it side by side here and what I'm going to do is drag and drop the keyboard layout file just like that your computer should say authenticate and I'll go ahead and type in my password and there we go next let's head over to system preferences and let's select the uh, keyboard inside a keyboard you have several tabs there that read keyboard text shortcuts and input sources we're going to go ahead and look inside the input sources. You see there I have two keyboard layouts, the English and Wendat keyboard layouts. I'm going to add by selecting the plus button. And we want to search for the Nebizod here, but it's not going to be shown there, so we're going to select others. And there we go. Select the Nebizod Navajo and select the add button. And it should show in the left column. On the menu bar, it will show the uh, keyboard layouts available to you. Make sure the keyboard tab, you select the input menu uh, for it to show in the input, for it to show in the menu bar. And let's test it out here. I'm going to open a Word document here and as you notice the font is still set to Arial and I'm going to select the Navajo keyboard layout I can do it manually or create a shortcut my shortcut on this machine is command spacebar and here we go and it shows all the characters appropriately and I'm going to try this in Google search engine here and everything looks fine and remember the keyboard layout characters you can type that anywhere in your machine system you can copy and paste anywhere inside of your system let me go back to Google here and I'm gonna paste and it pasted successfully and it held its characters again you don't need to use the uh, Navajo font inside of your office program if you notice on the right side it is set to the Arial font and I'm using the Navajo keyboard layout if you look to the top menu it's selected as the Denebizad Navajo keyboard layout Thanks for visiting. You can find more tutorials at academy.nativeinnovation.com. And thanks to Chris Harvey's language resource website. You can see that more of his uh, work at languagegeek.com. This is Kyla Winters with Native Innovation. Thanks for listening.